competing in the race today? Yep. We'll get your bird prepped for you. Just sit tight in the jockey lounge. And no wandering off, okay? Lovelier by the day. <laughs> uh-huh, sure I do. Oh, where are my manners? This here's Joe. He's one of Sam's jockeys. <laughs> and as much as it pains me to admit it, the man's far and away the best rider in the sport. A pleasure to make your acquaintance. This is Cloud, an up-and-coming star of the track. And all ours. Be sure to wave high when he lacks you. Well, sounds like you got a fan, son. I wonder, though, you win her over with your skills or with one of them smoldering looks? <laughs> Don't see why it can't be both. About time I had some competition, assuming Esther's not full of it. For both our sakes, I hope she isn't. <sighs> Forget him. The race is starting soon, so stay focused. Speaking of, you might want to consider practicing. The sim here can help with that.
Well, try not to get trampled out there. Trying to manifest a win here. Or we could team up, take Joe down a peg. Our ranch needs this win, so give it everything you got for us. You ready to make your debut in the racing world? will begin shortly. All participating jockeys, please proceed to the paddock. You good to go? survived that recent shooting. <sighs> You're not talking about the Coliseum, are you? Yes, I was there. Or I would have been had I not gone to the bathroom just before. That's amazing. <gasps> You're so lucky. Aren't I just? Which is why I know my bird's a winner. <laughs> Ooh, what a scrumptious looking parfait. And with plenty of butterscotch, I see. Bottoms up. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Get eyes on him. Oh, I'm fine, thanks. Do you know how hot it is out here? I'm melting. God, what asshole decided our uniforms had to be black? I'll be there as soon as I can. You freaking better. And bring something cold to drink. Or better yet, ice cream! Is vanilla No, okay? vanilla. Seriously? I'm gonna keep stroke over here! I'm gonna die! You want that? Do ya? <sighs> Wish you were here, partner.
winner. You're the real deal, kiddo. I just provided the encouragement. And thanks to you, my prison's gonna be a goddamn palace. Good for you. Ooh, so frosty. But here in the desert, we like it hot, fiery, dangerous. <laughs> yeah, I'll bet. Now where's our guy? Easy, Snowflake. Solemn Gus is a man of his word. Are you scared I'll break my promise? That tunnel over there will take you where you need to go. Past all that quicksand like a slippery little sidewinder. And at the other end, one of my beautiful vultures will be waiting to guide you through the desert. So be a good tourist. We got old Shooty McShooterson tied up nice and tight in a shack out in the scrapyard. But now he's all yours. Turn him over. Give him his just desserts. It's your call to make. There's no way Barry shot those people, right? Are there any other gun-armed dudes who might have gone on a killing spree? We know him. He'd never do that. Well, we'll find out soon enough. Need a light. 
on sand for weeks. Thank God we found you. We were worried. You on the lamp, big guy? The hell I am! Ugh. What are you guys doing all the way out here anyway? Looking for whoever decided to shoot up the Coliseum lobby. They said the culprit had a gun for an arm. They did, huh? Tell me it wasn't you. Frankly, it might as well have been. Barrett, talk to us. <sighs> I know the man who murdered all those people. Dine, my best friend. It was four years ago. The Corral Reactor had just gone up. Dine and I had been to check it out, see what the deal was. But on our way back... None of this makes any sense. That explosion could have brought down the whole mountain. So where the hell's Shinra? That's a damn good question. <sighs> Whatever. We need to get back and tell them what we found. God, no. Shinra, they just showed up and started shooting. I think they're trying to cover up what happened at the reactor. To pin the blame on... Hey! Uh, 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 please. This ain't happening. God damn it. The village. Marlene and Eleanor might still be there. Ready? For what? Still so quick to throw in the towel, ain't ya? Come on. 
has a reputation for safety to uphold. Which makes you liabilities. resigned myself to the fact that he was dead, but if I'd known he'd survive too, I... So that's why Dine shot all those people? To get back at Shinra? I don't know. I saw him at the saucer, saw the bodies and the bullet holes, but that's not who Dine is. Whatever his faults, he's not a monster. If I can find him, talk to him. I know we can figure this out. Well, okay. What are we waiting for? No time like the present.
And you're sure he's here? We're sure. Sorry, but I need to do this alone. Barrett. Go. Done. That you? Hey. I know you. Dine. Hang on. I'll get you out of here. <laughs> As I live and breathe, Barrett Wallace. Come on. Bless your heart, dropping by for Eleanor's birthday. What? Elle, Marlene, set a place for Barrett. <laughs> yeah, he's looking fit as a fiddle. Oh, good question. She ain't with him. Where's Myrna? She ought to be here. Come to think of it, I don't see a gift, neither. But you ain't the kind to come empty-handed. God damn it. his kind doing here you son of a bitch still living on shinra's kill no man it ain't like that <laughs> <laughs> you here to help me? <laughs> He's here for you to take the load off your shoulders, right? Same old shit. Just you and me, then. Right here. Right 
Thought you were here to help me. Nowhere to run. Come on, no. 
Elaine. I... I can't remember. <laughs> that leave me, huh? <clears throat> I thought you wanted to help your own buddy! It's tough, he's gone. Yeah, you're right. About everything. I should have never believed him. But that money... I thought it changed our lives. It changed them all right. You know, I can hear it now. 
Eleanor, as clear as day, begging me to stop, give you the benefit of the doubt, saying you ain't done nothing wrong. But then who's gonna answer for what happened? Oh, I know! Shinra! Always Shinra! His eyes. Hair, too. After everything went down, I didn't know what to do. Myrna was dead. And I figured you were, too. All I had was guilt and regret, and the weight of it was too much. But Marlene gave me the strength to carry on. She nearly died that day. House was about to come down when I heard her crying. And ever since, she's been my reason to get up in the morning. You took my baby girl from me. You knew she meant the world to me. You knew, and still you took her. That's not true. You took everything from me. Everything and everyone. Dad, we can go see Marlene right now. <sighs> Look at me, Barrett. You think I want Marlene to see what her father's become? Stop! With all this goddamn blood on my hands, how could I ever hold my daughter again?
Ah! <laughs> 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 